What is up everyone? Today another video and in today's video we're gonna talk about progressive overload. Welcome back everyone. Welcome to JR Jump for Health. My name is JR and on this channel I share my love and passion for jump rope fitness. So if you're into that, you can check me out on Instagram. If you like this video, if you like my content on Instagram, then follow, uh, leave a like, subscribe to the channel. Now let's get into the video. Progressive overload. So what is it? In case you didn't know, I'm gonna explain it to you in a very simple way. If you did know it, that's good. So progressive overload is when you increase the weight, frequency, or number of repetitions of your workout routine. In regards to jump roping, jumping rope, first week you'll jump two minutes, the next week you will up your minutes to maybe two uh, to five or to eight or to even 10 minutes, okay? So you're gradually increasing the stress on your muscles or your body to strengthen your body, to strengthen your muscles, to build muscles. And that's what I've been doing for the past three, four weeks in the gym actively. And why am I sharing this? Because I'm taking you on a journey, on my jump rope fitness journey, to maybe inspire you to do the same or be more active in your life. And it really helps. So yeah, that's why I'm sharing this. And I'm very happy because over the past days, the past weeks, I've been seeing a lot of progress and I'm very happy about that. I was not a fan of deadlifts, okay, or rows. I have a very weak back, I must say. It's not too muscular. It's one of my weaker muscles, I would say. So I tried to up my game when it comes to working out my back. So I started doing deadlifts and rows and lat pulls. And what I am most happy about is my isolateral rows and my deadlifts because I started three or four weeks ago doing deadlifts with 60 kilograms okay 60 kilograms and today I am at 95 kilograms and that is so amazing so I am really happy about how it's going and how much stronger I have gotten over the weeks because I was very insecure about doing those exercises because I have some back issues okay I'm 30 it's not really like very severe but I am getting older and I am feeling a lot of well not a lot of pain but I'm feeling some pain that I didn't have before so I thought I have to strengthen my back more and yeah it really helps so that's why I'm happy because it's taking away the pain I have less pain my back is getting stronger. What helped me a lot is this. This is my notebook I carry with me every time I go to the gym or do uh, workouts, okay? I write down everything I am doing. How much, how many repetitions, how heavy the weights I am lifting, how long I am jumping. I've been doing this for quite a time now and actually I need a new notebook because it's almost full. And this is really something that I recommend to do. It really helps me mentally, not just physically, but mentally, because I see my progress and it motivates me. It, it shows me that something is happening, that I'm doing something good for myself. And I feel very good about it. I feel very fit. I am very sure that anyone, that you can do it as well. Whatever your goals are, whatever you're after, you will achieve it in time, being patient, being dedicated, and just sticking to your routine and your plan. In the upcoming videos, I want to go more into detail about how I got stronger with jump ropes, okay? How I was able to go from 2 minutes to 5 minutes, from 5 minutes to 10 minutes, from 10 minutes to a half an hour, to from 30 minutes to an hour, over an hour jumping with minimal pauses in between, okay? Alright, that's what I wanted to share in this video. I hope I made sense somehow. If I did, then yeah! I'm very happy if it helped you somehow or I could somehow inspire you, okay? I'll see you in the next one. My name is JR and I am out.